So you got an award recently. Yeah. Do you want to tell us? The President's Award, the Gashka, they call it, yeah. That's huge. Yeah, well, that, it took me three years three year to complete it. There's three different levels to it. You have the bronze, silver, and then you have gold. I, I, got, I learned about the Gashka to go to Red Cross again. Like, uh, I think it was Governor O'Brien came in. We had a, a Red Cross. We are doing the Red Cross. and It's part of the Red Cross. I think it's once a month. Do we, you get meetings. You have meetings, we say, with the Governor and Chiefs. This week and then the following the following month, and might be having a meeting with the medics, and then the following month it could be psychology. Mm. No, we're talking about things within the prison, trying to make it a safer place. Like, and I think it was Governor Brian comes in one one morning and we're chatting away, and he mentions the gasket to me, and I was saying, yeah, yeah, I wouldn't mind, I wouldn't mind doing that. My brother was here at the time, and he started with me as well, and we started. Like fair play to Governor Ryan, he's very he was very good to me as well. Like you know, mm. like he gave me he gave me chances as well. Like and we started, but I finished the bronze. And my brother finished it as well. The two of us finished it together. The bronze went down for was it thirteen weeks or sixteen weeks or something? And you have to do three three uh, activities for the for the thirteen weeks. And you have to do a physical physical activity. That could be for the gym. You might do yeah. the gym once a week. Then you have to do the community. I done the Red Cross for the community and for the personal. It was a job I had at the time. I was working in the hurley shop where we learned to fix hurleys and yeah. making benches and all that kind of crack. And we finished that, we got a medal, got the bronze medal and I went on to the silver. I think that goes on for 26 weeks of silver then. And uh, for the community, for the silver, I joined the the Smartens, the listeners, mm. and I was getting assigned by them every every week. They were coming in every Sunday. And for the physical, I was away away at the gym, like and we'd we like you have to do like a team a teamwork activity as well. You know to come into the end of the end of each course, you have to do like a teamwork activity. Yeah. And for the silver, the silver one, I um. I organised a, a fundraiser for Penny Dinners. Brilliant. And uh, I got one euro off each prisoner in the prisons, and that came up to 300 euro. And then Governor Bryan said to me that he'd double it, he'd throw another 300 euro to it, um, and we send it out to uh, Catherine Tomey or something. Yeah, yeah. yeah, she was on the podcast before. Yeah, and uh, that was done anyway. And like, this way at the gym, and for the, pers- for the personal one, it was. A, I was. I think I was trying to become a, a COVID cleaner or something. Yeah, I trained to become a COVID cleaner in, in the, the prison because I was cleaning, cleaning. I was cleaning the yards at the time. It was a, as a job, like you know. And uh, for the gold one, then it got, that goes on for a full year. And it was, I was doing the, I done my leaving cert for the gold one. For the for the personal one, I was still yeah. I still was involved with the Red Cross and the Samaritans. And I was in the gym, and it was uh, for the personal one. Then kind of had to chop and change with it because school was closed, so mm. I couldn't come up to the school the whole time and stick at something in the school. So I could be stood. I might have to study something for six weeks, and then change something else and do something else. And you know, there was there was a lot of lot, a lot of hard work on it. Can but imagine, uh, yeah. it paid off anyway. Like you know, you got, the, got the gold medal. Congratulations. Yeah, thanks, man. It's great, or three years' work and not to finally get the achievement at the end yeah, of it. Yeah, yeah. Well, how do you feel about that? Like, does, is it just, like, this, I'm speaking out from my own experience. Can you accept that as a really good achievement? Are you, do, you, are you, do you feel proud of yourself, basically? Of course I am, man. 100% I, you should be. That was the biggest thing I've ever done in my life.